Dog owners in Hamden have an off-leash park, but other communities aren't as fortunate. There are currently 28 off-leash dog parks in Connecticut. In the New Haven area alone, there are six parks for people to take their canine friends. They include Branford, Edgewood, Eisenhower, Hamden, Middlefield, and Yale Divinity School. In Hamden, many residents feel this is a great place to make new friends with other dog lovers and give their dogs the exercise and fun they need. Well, my dog is super high energy and a dog park allows her to run, to socialize, interact with other dogs, other people. Um, but also, it's, it's relaxing, it's fun to watch the, the dogs all play together and it's nice to get to meet other dog people. Here, dogs can play with their owners and fellow dogs in the large wooded area seen here. It also provides a safe space and a healthy space for the dogs to be dogs. However, Wallingford residents still don't have a dog park of their own. While some local Wallingford residents come here just for the fun of the swing set and the playground, other locals have been trying to form a coalition to create a dog park on one acre of land here. And with the help of the local Parks and Recreation Department, they're hoping to get this plan swing into action. It'd be awesome. It would be very, I would use it a lot and it would be fun and my dog would enjoy it. I see a lot of dogs here when I'm walking my dog, and I think we could use it. The plan must take into account, though, the issues of noise, time, money, and waste pickup that go hand-in-hand -hand with creating a park. Wallingford resident Mark Semra is leading the group to raise the $25,000 needed to build and keep the one acre of land at Community Lake Park, but he still needs more help. If you would like to get involved in this project, please contact the Parks and Recreation Department here in Wallingford. For Quinnipiac University, this is Jill Talbot.